Today we will be talking about the improvised making of a hand bomb. When there is no enough t uh, time uh, for making uh, more complex explosive devices, a hand bomb can be made very easily. For the making of this bomb we need an explosive cartridge, uh, of a cylindrical or a bottleneck shape or plastic explosive, detonating capsule, uh, a smaller piece of uh, slow, slow burning fuse, uh, rope or uh, linen and nails. <clears throat> it is made in the following way. Into the explosive cartridge um, of 100 or 200 grams, or into the same um, amount of plastic explosive, we placed a de detonating capsule with the uh, um, piece of um, slow burning fuse. Uh, with a piece of slow burning fuse uh, that we make sure does not touch the explosive cartridge. Then with rope or linen we uh, tie this slow burning fuse uh, in such a way that uh, it cannot fall out while we are throwing the bomb out of the explosive cartridge. Around the explosive we place nails um, into one or more, more rows and then afterwards uh, we tie it all very strongly with linen or rope out around the explosive cartridge. Uh, it is better to use uh, less uh, nails of the length of 5 to 6 centimeters. If we do not have enough such nails, we can uh, shorten longer nails so that we get a sufficiently long 5 to 6 cm nails. If we don't have nails, we can use pieces of hard wire. Depending on the experience of handling explosive, the cartridge can also be made smaller if needed. Uh, plastic explosive can be made into whatever shape is most suitable for throwing. Uh, the process of lighting this uh, bomb is as follows. Uh, you light the slow burning fuse with a match, a lighter or a cigarette and um, watch pr uh, precisely uh, how long it burns. When the fuse burns um, to the length that ensures uh, security, it is time to prepare ourselves to throw the bomb. And then we throw the bomb. That's all for today. Thank you for listening.